Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and I've done a video almost like this, but not this to this scale. Uh, somebody posted on Facebook they wanted to do a 10-foot wall with 12-inch tile. This is easy, kind of, and fun. I've set my page on 10 feet by 10 feet, so it doesn't really matter. And you do not have to use, well, you're not going to use my graphic, but I just picked one out of the blue. And I'm going to go to the polygon tool, and I'm going to go down to the graph paper tool. And I'm going to hold down my control button. And I've already selected 10 tile by 10 tile. And then when you select off of it with the pick tool, you can change it to 120 inches. And if your ratio is locked, then you only have to do it one time. I'm going to hit P and put it in the center of the page. Then I'm going to take my graphic and I'm going to go to arrange power clip place inside frame. And I'm going to place it inside the frame. Now I'm going to select the whole thing and I'm going to go up to arrange and I'm going to ungroup it. Now every tile is separated. So you just need to kind of watch, you know, the tile so you don't have to run these tiles. But let's just back up here. Let's say your laser bed is, uh, I don't know what size your laser bed is, but these are pretty big tiles. So let's get them off the, the bed for a second. And let's change our bed to, let's say you have a helix that's uh, 24 by 18. So you're only going to be able to run two tile at a time. And I would just keep track of the ones you run. So let's just take these two tile. I'm going to hold down the shift key and select both of them. I'm going to bring them over to my laser bed and they just barely fit. And I'm going to grab that corner. I'm going to stick them up the top left corner. And I evidently don't have snap to on. So let's go to view and snap to. I do have snap to page on, so it must have snapped. So then you would run those two tile and then just kind of move them out of the side off your deal. Select that one and this one with your shift key and then just move them over your laser bed and run those two. And just keep in mind that you don't have to run all the, well, I don't know what your graphic, this is quite a bit of wasted tile, but it would look really cool on a wall, whatever graphic you decide. And if you just happen to have a bigger laser bed, you can do more tile. Anyway, I hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.